Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG48, and we are back with a journey of life. All right, guys. So we need more crafting stations, okay? Um, I tried to get this uh, this lantern working, but the thing is you need oil for it, right? Uh, lights up environment can be filled with oil. Where do I get oil? I have no freaking clue. Also, we have gone through all of our... Um, coconuts and honestly i don't feel like going to get more and the fruit that you can get from the trees in my area are not really that great so i think what we have to do is we have to start thinking about farm plots and food uh, i want to get oil so we're just going to make a bunch of um crafting stations today and then i'm going to show you a trick on how to get these uh, these little gear things i forget what these things are called these connectors they can actually go through walls horizontal connectors all right. There's a YouTuber I watched by the name of Cuban Cigar who showed me how to do it. So shout out to Cuban Cigar, and um, I'm going to show you how to do that in a little bit. But let's get let's get the composter made first. I would really like to start farming some items. So let's see what we need for the composter. All right. So a bunch of straight sticks and rope should not be a problem. Uh, straight sticks and ropes. So we're going to take that rope, and I think I have some rope somewhere else in here too. Where are my sticks and my rope? There's the straight sticks. Is that enough? It doesn't even look like it's enough. I'm going to take some of these so we can get some more straight sticks. There's more rope. Okay, and that's looking good. So let's go ahead and put the composter down. I don't know where it's going to go, like, permanently. So for now, I'm just going to keep it inside. All right, so... Where are you, composter? There we go. All right, uh, I guess let's put it over here for now. Pretty good spot for it. And let's take out... Do we have a building hammer? I forgot. Yeah, the building hammer. Okay. There we go. And buildy, buildy, buildy. Yeah, I'm going to need more straight sticks. That's for damn sure. I mean, you can tell why it takes a bunch of straight sticks. Just look at it, right? Makes total sense. Three, two, one, two. Wow, I had enough sticks. I didn't think I had that much sticks on me. But... All right, that's cool. So now what do we, now what do we need for that? We need to... um. Used for making compost. Rotten fruits and unusable leaves. Ooh, unusable leaves. Hold on. Hold on. Are these unusable leaves? No, those are researchable leaves. Those are researchable too. I don't know what unusable leaves are. Um, yeah, let's just try and put them in there. It doesn't hurt, right? I'm assuming it won't let me put them in there if, if it's not the ones I'm supposed to use. So let's take a look. Not that these are unusable, but... Oh, okay, so those leaves do count. So let's see what leaves count, because maybe uh, maybe, maybe a lot of these leaves count. I didn't mean to pick that up. Uh, let's go ahead and drop that on the ground. And then let's go ahead and put these sticks away so we can make some room. And I'm going to put that iron, iron flat bar away. I don't know what I'm going to need it for, but I'm sure I'm going to need it for something. And let's grab these leaves. And what about dry grass patch? Probably not dry grass patch, but who knows. Who knows? 6% total. Now, do I have to put this out in the sun? Does it, have to, it doesn't say it has to be anywhere, so I'm assuming it works wherever you put it. Oh, yeah. All right. I'm going to put all these in here to hell with it. There we go. All right. Dry patch does not work. That is just fine. Okay, cool. Uh, What else do I want? Do I want to put more leaves in there, or do I want to wait? Hmm... I think we'll wait. I don't think it matters to put it up to 100. I don't know what total or done means. <laughs> I don't know if there's something I'm supposed to be doing to this thing. I don't. Yeah, so I'm just going to let it go. Or maybe maybe you have to put 100% in. Do you think you have to put 100% in? I guess it's not out of the realm of possibility. I forget what I get from these, le from these bushes. Let's see what we get from these bushes. Okay, that's not going to help. That's not going to help. All right, yeah, I don't think I get anything from these bushes that I can actually put in there. Okay. Uh, oh, here we go. Got these bad boys. I probably shouldn't use all of these in the composter, because I am going to need these for making other things. Um, but I think there's a lot of them in the area, so I don't really think it's that big of a deal, to be honest. So let's go ahead and chop all these up and throw those in the comp composter. All right, I got the thing about half full. Uh, I think I'm, I'm not going to fill it up. Uh, I think What I want to do is I want to research some of these leaves. I think research can be pretty cool right now, too. I'd also like to get a, a rain catch going. The problem is it's never rained um, in my world. So even here, it's never rained. So what I'm hoping I could do is boil water. Hey, what's going on, rabbit? I'm not going to kill him. His meat will go bad by the time I eat it. 
Um, all right, so let's come over here and drop the rest of this stuff in here. I don't think you need to fill it. I don't see why you would. All right, and then that we're going to save that for researching. All right, so first things first. Let's go ahead and make a clay pot. And then we're going to see if we can boil some water. Now, I tried to boil, boil water when I, got the oil, when I got the water out of the ocean, and it didn't work. You know, it gave me salt, which is pretty interesting. It's probably used for something. Uh, but it did not give me clean water. Uh, you can't... I guess... I always thought you could boil salt, salt water uh, to get real water out of it, but apparently you can't. Um, so that's interesting. Learn something new every day. And um, my, my tongue's bothering me, by the way. Uh, my commentary is going to be a little weird today. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what happened last night, but like I think because my allergies, I've got like swollen like um, I got a swollen like jaw like throat type area, you know, from allergies, and uh, I think it's made my tongue swell too. So I freaking bit my tongue. I think in my sleep, and now it's like it's just a, it's a pain in the ass. It is a pain in the butt. Talks. Oh, if I could ask you guys a favor, and I might know by the time you tell me, but just in case uh, I don't get told. Can you guys tell me, uh, where do I get the stuff for the fire starters? Because I don't remember. I don't remember. I did it, like, in episode one. I can always go back and watch episode one, and I will if I have to. But, um, I'd prefer not to. Um, I can't believe I don't remember where I... You need, like, a dry base or something for it, or something. I don't know. Something crazy like that. Alright, let's go ahead and get some water. So, um, that is in my hands, right? So how do I hold the E to fill? Pot needs to be baked. Oh, duh. Of course it does. Right now it's just a it's just a clay bowl. It won't take long. Five, four, three, two, one, baked. Baked. There we go. Alright, so let's go ahead and fill that up. Okay. There we go. Dirty, dirty water. Now if we can get this to, if we can get this to boil, our water situation will be taken care of. And then we won't have to worry about the fruit if we can get a farm going. The farm's obviously the, the next thing I want to do. Alright. Oh, dude, it took like two seconds. Seriously? Really? Did that literally take like two seconds? Huh. It says water. Let's go ahead and drink it. How do we drink it? Drop, cancel. It's in my hands. Um, I guess I could put it down. Uh, drink. It's cooling down. I put it there. Right? And then five. Hold E. Hold E. Hold E. <laughs> I guess it's got to be in my hands. Hold on. All right. Hold E to drink from pop. Oh, beautiful. Oh, just beautiful. I'm not going to have to worry about water anymore. That is just fantastic. All right, let's put that fire out. We'll work with this again later. Oh, that's that's wonderful. Oh my god. Now we can just get a farm going. We got fruit take. If we can get like a farm going and we get food taken care of, we'll be good to go. That is awesome. All right, cool. Let's check this out. Still zero percent done. I don't know how long that takes. I asked in Discord. They said you don't have to do anything with it. Um, I moved it outside by the way, just for the lulls. Um, Discord said you don't have to do anything with it. You just let it do its thing. So I was like, okay. Okay, Discord. Alright, do you want to do a pottery station next? I thought there was something else I wanted to do that wasn't a pottery station. Um, no, I guess not. Well, the farm plots, we can't do those yet. Oh, yeah, herb station. Yes. Small clay pot. Small clay bottle. You know what? I might actually need the, um, the clay station first. Clay bottle. I don't, I don't see a clay bottle in here. Yeah. All right, we're going to need the station first. The pottery station. So, let's go ahead and make that now. Let's put it right there. Let's get this thing built. Okay, we're going to need two stone wheels for the pottery wheel. One and two. Craft that bad boy up. All right. Come over here. This thing is just about finished. Well, did I say just about? I meant it is finished. Okay, now we can make a uh, small clay bottle, soup pots, clay, all kind of clay cups, all kinds of stuff. Cool. Let's get some clay and let's get the um, let's get that herb station made. I don't know how much clay I'm gonna need. I'll just take uh, I'll take a, I'll take quite a few. Inventory is so limited. All right, so for this station, we are going to need where is it? Herb station. We're gonna need two small clay bottles, three. Small clay pots. 
two bottles, three three pots. Uh, two. Oh boy, we need a lot more clay, man. Nope. Good for me. I actually saved some up. Is this gonna be enough? I don't know. I can always go go get some more. There's plenty of clay in the river. Should not be a problem. Excuse me. All right, there we go, and one more pot and two bottles. Nope, not three bottles. Two bottles. Well, whatever. I'll make extra bottles. Who cares? I'll probably need them eventually anyway. Can you build with stuff off the ground? Wait, I can't do it here anyway. I need to carry it over there. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. Well, let's go ahead and place it down. I should have just placed it down anyway. It's so weird that, like, I don't place it down unless I have all the items. I'm like, no, you don't need all the items. Um, that's the hand grind. That's the herb station. Put that right there, I guess. I think it's backwards, but who cares? All right, so we're going to need some planks. I got planks, guys. Oh, I got planks for days. The problem is I don't have any inventory space. So let's go ahead and do that and that. All oh, those bottles are cool. It's going to be nice to decorate with those. Two from there. Two from here. Now, right here, I am, I'm redoing the setup here again. I'm going to show you how to run, um, you know, those connectors through walls. That's why this is in the way, by the way. Um, we'll probably do that as soon as this thing's done. Oh, God. I, I needed five planks, not two, Cage. And I can't carry them. All right. We got the herb station done. And let's take a look at it. Uh, we could research. It seems like there's only two plants to research, I guess. Or we can look at the crafting list. And there's the crafting list. It's how you make seeds, by the way. As a matter of fact, let's make a couple seeds right now. Because that seems pretty good. And what we'll do is we're going to go grab those two. I don't remember. Uh, it's been a couple hours since I recorded because I had to go out and have lunch with the wife. But, um, yeah, so we have, these are the only leaves we have. I don't know where we get the other ones. I'll probably stumble upon the other ones at some point, And then I'll deal with it. But um, for now, I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, so what, what do I do here? Do I... Drag these in there, or... Doesn't seem like I drag it in there. I don't, I'm not really sure. Research progress. Okay, so how do we research? I don't know. Maybe uh, drop it on top of there. It won't let me do that. Hold on. Let's 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 turn this thing around. Let's see if that helps us out any. Okay, let's leave it right there for now. Okay. Research. Oh, Look. Okay, I see. So do I have to drop stuff on there for the research? Yeah, that's how you do it. All right, cool. Very cool. So we'll do some more research and um, uh, let's get out of there. Did I get two seeds or one? Hmm, I think I only got one seed. Where is my other seed? Does it take two to make one seed? Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, maybe I missed something there. Maybe I, maybe I have the seed in my inventory. I'm just not seeing it. I don't know. I only see one seed in here, though. That's fine. No big deal. All right. So let's go ahead and check our composter. There we go. And take some out. How much was that? Just one? 10% is only one? Oh, my God. Wow. All right. All right. I think I need five to make any kind of uh, compost thing. I think the, the easiest one was five. So that's gonna that's gonna take a little bit more time than I was imagining. So farm plot, yeah, four slots, and that takes five compost. Okay, all right, fair enough. All right, I'm getting kind of hungry, and I'm trying not to use the um the fruit because I I gotta use the fruit for other things. So I'm gonna see if I can chase down this rabbit. I've done it before, but never on camera. Uh, see, maybe I should make a weapon, like an actual weapon. I could probably make a bow or something. Come on, you freaking rabbit. Stop running. The one I killed, he, like, stopped. Like, for no reason. So, I'm not sure if that's going to be a normal thing. He's running underwater. Come on. Come on. All right. All right. You you win this one, rabbit. You win this one. But we're going to have to, you know, think about something with food. Uh, like I said, I could probably make a bow or something. Hold on. Let's try and get this one. Come on. You die now. Oh, he's right there. How did I not hit him? There we go. Got him right in his stupid face that time. <laughs> That's what happens. They, I guess they get tired or whatever. Or maybe the, the AI is not that good yet. But yeah, they usually just stop. And that's when I, I get him in the head with the axe. 
So what I'm going to do now is we need... Oh, I, I still need to look up where to get that dry material for fire starting things. I want to I want to have fire starting things everywhere because, like, I always have to go find the damn thing. And I don't want to keep it in my inventory because it takes up room. There it is. By the way, this is burnt. Can I destroy it? Yes. No. Drop. I think if I drop it, it's just going to stay on the ground, so... Maybe I can burn it. I'll try and do something with it later. It's just in the way. Doing me no good at all. So when you cook stuff, you have to, like, sit there and watch it. Like, very closely. I think it burns pretty quickly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start that fire. Start that fire. There we go. And then we will put these on there. And we will keep an eye on them. See how long it takes them to cook. I don't think it's going to take them that long. Oh my god, guys. I have been researching for well over an hour on Discord with everybody. Um, I've got so much to catch you guys up on between this and last cut that I'm going to try not to like let anything slip through the cracks. Alright, first of all, I don't have enough food. I went ahead and got some coconuts. Um, if you go ahead down the right side of the waterfall, there's a little area over there with coconut trees. So I went ahead and got some coconuts because I'm not going to have food done in time. So I just bit the bullet and I went and got some coconuts. Hopefully this will be the last set of coconuts I have to go get. At least I have coconuts down there. Also on the way back I found some um, mango seeds. Which is pretty good. I love mangoes. Um, okay, so right here let's finish up our research. Uh, I gotta go get the... Um, the hold on. E. I keep forgetting you gotta hit E to get out of that menu. Um, I have the leaves somewhere in here. I just don't remember where I put them. A little bit unorganized. Um, guys, there is so much to this game. I've got like a million and one things I'm trying to get straight in my head. Um, I went ahead and picked some red berries. There's blueberry bushes out there, and I'll tell you about the meat in a minute. There's blueberry bushes out there, but they don't give me blueberries for some reason. So I'm not really sure um, what the deal is with that. But I do have a lot of seeds, a lot of food. We should be okay for a little while. Let's go ahead and put this down here. That's not what I wanted to do. Why is that not going down there? I think it is down there. Hold on. Five? Yeah, it is down there. It just looks like a, a shovel for some reason. All right, let's go ahead and finish our research. All right, there we go. This should be done. I don't know what this is going to do for me, but... Okay, popular med, uh, medicinal plant used for diarrhea, respiratory... Okay, so that says... That's all the... That's what it said before. I don't know what finishing up the research does for me. What does it do? Does it give me something else to craft? Hmm, I don't know. Maybe it's not finished. Maybe I have to get another one. Maybe... Maybe it's got a little bit more to go. Don't know. All right, the meat, guys. Okay, so the meat. Let's talk about the meat. It's what's for dinner. All right, first of all, let's go ahead over here. Uh, actually, I, I won't grab the, the fire starter. We're not going to start the fire. All right, so I put the meat on the fire, okay? All right, they were both stacks of meat. So one stack was under another stack. The, the stack on the bottom burned. stack on the top was raw, okay? So what I did with the second one was I put the second one on there. It got too hot, and it went from raw to burnt. And what I was told is you have to put the meat, like, kind of on the sides and watch the temperature. So, yeah, that's something I'm going to have to look at next time I get some meat. But, all right, th this, is this is what I really wanted to show you in this video. Let's get to it. This is awesome. Um, I'm going to try and remember, I'm going to really, really try and remember to link his YouTube channel. Cuban Cigar, okay, is the one who showed me this. He plays this game as well. And um, this is the way he he did this. He, he has, he set it up so these... Um, connectors can go through the wall okay so let's go ahead and get this off of there come on get this out here come on go somewhere all right fine whatever we can keep you right there for now uh that can stay where it is okay so what you want to do first is you want to build up the wall okay so and i hope i remember how to do this so you build the wall leave it as a ghost image then you build you put down all the connectors through the wall, finish the wall, bada bing, bada boom, Bob's your uncle, and every everyone's happy. Everyone goes home happy. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Uh, by the way, I'm not going to use the big connector because I it was kind of bothering me that I was using all small connectors and then one big connector. I know it really doesn't matter. I might not even use another connector. I might just do this and then this. Um, oh, hold on. Hold on. How did he do this? Okay. Hold on, maybe I'm wrong. Let's go ahead and do this. Uh, destroy mode. Delete that. And then put this down. Nope, get out of build mode. Put this down. 
Okay, and then put the wall down. There you go. Can't place this structure. Oh, how did he do this? Can't place structure requires pillar two. Well, it does have two support pillars. It's got to be the it's got to be the things coming through it. All right, so this is an incredibly useful piece of information I'm about to give you guys. I didn't know why Cuban Cigar could put his thing through the wall, okay? I thought it could just go through the wall if it was connected and, and so be it. It's not really the case. You can see right there, can't go through the wall. But I went back and watched his video, okay? The connector was touching the wall, okay? So I was thinking about maybe moving this back or maybe adding another connector. And then I realized I had a big vertical connector. So let's put the big vertical connector in and that's gonna touch the wall. Once it touches the wall, Boom. Magic. That is some effing magic right there. Oh my god. I gotta remember to put a link in the description of this channel. Um, thank you so much for that. That was freaking awesome. Okay. Now we gotta decide where we wanna put this thing. I want this thing kind of like out of the way. So I think we're gonna do another turn here. Like so. And then put it like that. And I'll just put it here for now. Um, I might move it I might move it around later depending on what I do with the build. But for now, that's really, really nice. That is incredibly... Oh, I don't like the way that's turned. Um, hold on. Not that it doesn't matter which way it's turned. But I kind of want it to be facing... Can you turn it? Yeah, there we go. kind of want it to be facing... Uh, why isn't it turning? Alright, I don't know. It's not letting me turn it. That doesn't make much sense, it being like that. I'll mess around with it off camera, see if I can get it turned in a way that makes sense. Um, yeah, so that's cool. Why did I break the um, the door here? I don't know. I shouldn't have. <laughs> I don't know why I broke the door here. All right, there we go. Put that right there. And another thing I was thinking was taking out these walls and moving this back because I don't like the way this is such a small area to come through here. So I think we're going to do that. I think we're going to destroy this. When you destroy stuff, you do get stuff back, by the way. Uh, we're also going to destroy this. And then we are going to put... Mm, yeah, let's destroy that too. There we go. Okay. And then we're going to do now is we're going to put... Should we put another window back here? I kind of think another window back here would be pretty cool. Um, that means we have to put down some poles first. Okay. Uh, we got to get out of destroy mode. There we go. And that looks pretty good. Okay. Now windows. Window. Make this a doorway. Okay. And that looks pretty good. Now this is going to give us a lot more room to... To walk around here. I, I like that a lot. I like that a lot more. I really, really do. So let's go ahead and upgrade those. Um, I don't have my hammer with me. I don't carry my hammer around with me anymore because I don't use it that much. So I only get it when I actually need it. And I need to organize these chests. You know, another thing that would be cool in this game is signs. I'd love to have signs. No, really, where did I put my hammer? You know, so you could hang like, oh, this is my tool chest. This is my food chest. You know, stuff like that. I don't know where the hell I put my hammer. I thought I put it in here, but I'm not seeing it. Dude, that is so freaking weird. That's the blacksmith hammer in there. <laughs> it didn't look like a hammer. It just looked like a handle. All right. Well, it is what it is. Let's go ahead and pick these up. We're going to need a lot more than we have already, but that's okay. I've got a lot of resources over here. No problem. Although I do have stuff taking up inventory space. So let's, uh, let's just drop this stuff off the ground for now. I will pick it up and do something with it later. Just so we can carry more stuff. There we go. And check it out. Beautiful. Beautiful. Love it. Absolutely love it. We need to make some doors at some point, too. I don't know when that's going to happen, but... Alright, we need the small planks, don't we? Alright, so let's go ahead and put some of these away. Probably need some of these as well. I didn't look at exactly what we needed. But eh, we don't have a lot of small planks. I'm going to have to go cut up some more... Some more small planks. Stop jumping over stuff, Cage. Walk around the way you're supposed to. You built this thing in a specific way, and you're supposed to walk around, and that's it. I need more planks. All right, guys, just moving some stuff around here. I did get this thing built up over here, and I think this is much, much nicer um, the way it is now. Freaking cool. Um, you know what I'd like to be able to do also for the windows? Make shutters for the windows. I think that'd be pretty neat. So, all right. Well, I did get a rabbit in between... Uh, in between cuts. So I think for the end of this video, we're going to try and go cook a rabbit and not burn it. Um, like I said, I think I'm supposed to keep the rabbit to the edges. Maybe if it gets too hot, I kind of, um, you know, pick it up. Um, I need to figure out another fire starter. <laughs> Again, I can't believe I don't know what to do with how to make another fire starter. I'm going to have to watch my video 
from the beginning, just to see. All right. I'm sure you guys will let me know in the comments by then, but either way. All right, so there we go. We got that sucker started. Okay. So in order to split stacks, you hold down shift or shift right click or hmm, control. I thought they said that I, I thought the person said hold down shift and drag it into your inventory. Okay, you hold down shift as you drag it out of your inventory onto the ground and then it'll give you a number. So just one, please. Just leave that right there. Is that going to cook that close, you think? So is that the heat of the piece of meat? I think it is. That might actually be too close. Yeah, now it's now it's going down. So you got to keep an eye on the heat, basically. So we'll put it right there. And now it's starting to get hot. I guess you want it to be like somewhere in the in the medium range, I guess. I don't know. I think you go a little closer. All right, all right, starting to go up a little bit, maybe a little bit closer. There we go. See, that's that. I think that's too high, right? I don't think you want it up that high. That's kind of weird though. Like I barely put it any closer, and all of a sudden it just shot up. I think we're good. Oh, there we go. Half. Yep, just a little bit over half. Now nope, it's dropping. All right. Well, let's just keep right there. I think that that's probably a pretty good temperature to cook it at. Oh, there we go. Cooked. It's weird. As soon as I looked away, it, it went to cooked. Interesting. All right, now we're going to try and put it on top, but we're going to put it on the edge. As close to the edge as possible. And maybe it'll cook a little bit quicker. I wonder if I could actually eat this raw. According to the stats, I think I could just eat it raw. But I'm not going to eat it raw because that, that sounds gross. So let's see how long it takes this thing to cook. Okay, that didn't even take that long. Okay, so you definitely want to... By the way, I think this one might got a little bit overcooked. Because you see how it's like negative on the um, thirst. And that one I think was perfect. Or maybe it's because I put that one on the ground. I really don't know. But either way, all right, we know how to cook now. And since we know how to cook, now you guys know how to cook. All right, I got to call this episode, guys. We got a hell of a lot done today. It's been awesome. I just want to record the next one right now. I might be able to. I might not. We'll see. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. So I'm going to say thank you again because you guys are awesome. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.